Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we're getting down to the wire in the UEFA Champions League tonight. The first leg of the semi-final coming right up. It's Benfica taking on Liverpool. Well, what a moment for both these teams. Just one step away from the final. But it's the visitors and their fans that are expecting to get through to the big day. But this is by no means an easy game for them, as their host can be really dangerous if they play at their best. Nicolas Otamendi starts with Jan Vertonghen at the back. Joao Mario plays with Julian Weigel in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Diogo Jota. Alexander Arnold. And I'd be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Well, I think, Stuart, you have to feel for any defender charged with the task of keeping Mo Salah quiet. He can be fantastic to watch. Well, Derek, over the years, he's scored so many goals. It's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defenders at such pace. When the ball's played in behind, nobody catches him, and he often gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, and we know what the result is. Might really be able to trouble them here. Sadio Mane in the middle. Can they take the lead here? Not out of the woods yet. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Alexander Arnold. Jota. Making sure it didn't get past him. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. And in with a real chance. Just straying offside. intercepting it Rafa well it could be on for him here determined defending and now the delivery the chance is on Rafa in position and a promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end Mane Mane and Thiago oh brilliant goalkeeping
Henderson. Now Mane. Salah. Must take the lead here. No way through. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Can he give them the lead? And there it is! The first goal of the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. of something positive Joao Mario this could level it oh but the keeper with an important save how important is that well he should score from there that's a wasted opportunity he should beat the keeper from that sort of distance can someone get on the end of this and a struggle to get it away properly well, they survived the attack. Breaking at pace. Has a go. And that's a straightforward stop. Thiago. Diogo Jota. Henderson has it. Keeper has possession of it. Thiago. And we will have just one additional minute. Jota. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here well truly phenomenal from Jordan Henderson his contribution in the first half what did you make of it well it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad obviously he got his goal to put them in front but he's looked lively throughout too hopefully we see more of him in the second half second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. And Mohamed Salah now. Well, nothing productive really. Jota. Can he put it away? Here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Well, a 
second goal for them here. Julian Weigel. Yaremchuk. Good technique displayed. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Alexander Arnold. And this is Diogo Jota now. Fabinho. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Joao Mario and it's with Roman Yaremchuk a good and fair challenge a Liverpool free kick coming up It's Mane getting forward effectively. In towards Salah. And it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. He certainly wasn't offside by a mile. And the substitution will occur now. Alexander Arnold, Fabinho, Jota. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Substitution. Played over. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Joao Mario. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Darwin Nunez. And Liverpool come away with it. Henderson. And Mane in the thick of things. And the danger's still on. Fabinho. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. And great use of the ball to keep possession. And they need to get tighter. And disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. Keeper there to collect. Virgil van Dijk. And this is Diogo Jota now. Jota. A really sumptuous ball. 
And the jump of that ball played in rather well. And Mohamed Salah now. Really good block. Jota. Salah. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. Oxley Chamberlain. A glorious chance. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat trick. Well, let's take another look. It's a really well tried pass to Black Lodge sideline. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for foul. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. taking a lead with them into the return leg. Well, they were really good today. Their approach play, their movement off the ball, and of course their finishing were excellent, as was their work rate. A disciplined performance in the second leg, and they're into the final.